welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's me, Destiny <laughs> Shanti. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. I'm sorry, okay? And you guys can flame me about my hair too. If you guys are really mad at me, I don't really care. I deserve it. But listen, listen, let me explain, okay? So basically... All right, so yesterday. Well, what happened was... <laughs> um, work was just like, you know, it was a lot of, it was a lot. I'm about to say it's a lot of work because it's work. Anyways, it was a lot to deal with because like I told you guys in the last video, I was working from 9 to 5 and it was crazy. <laughs> It was crazy because I was barely getting to sleep because this summer still, like, I'm still a teenager. So, of course, I was still, like, going to sleep late even though I know I should, shouldn't be. But the thing is, I was always tired and I just didn't feel like do. I just didn't feel like making any videos because I was just always tired or getting home late. And it was just a lot. But I'm back now. I'm back and I'm better. Well, actually, no, because my mental health got worse. Anyways. The point is, I'm back to you guys, and I miss you guys, and I've been wanting to make videos, and I have a lot of ideas, so here I am. Here I am. Also, um, my hair looks crazy, but I'll fix it. I'll fix it by the end of this video, okay? But anyways, so let me just, let me just explain to y'all what we're doing today. Today, I am making a video... And I am doing a euphoria look. I'm doing a look. Right? And if you guys don't know the show Euphoria, it's a show from, I think it's on HBO. Yeah, it's on HBO. And it's basically about, like, all these teenagers that have, like, their own personal problems. And they're just trying to figure out their life. And they also have a lot of editorial looks in that show. So that's the part of the show that, a lot of people know it for is their looks and so i'm going to be doing one of those looks today on me and now i'm going to be making a tiktok and i'm putting it in here so you guys can see the tickety tock and it has the song also the songs their songs are so that's what i'm doing today and i got a shirt on that kind of that kind of looks like a shirt that um Maddie wear if you do watch the show then you know who Maddie is and it has like these flares. I got it from Sheen. I'm gonna put it in the I'm gonna put it down below so you guys know. But yeah, this is the shirt. Um my mom doesn't actually like this shirt, but it really goes with the Euphoria theme, so I decided to wear because it it's lavender and then it's a cute funky shirt that I think Maddie will wear. So that's the shirt. Let me lower this so y'all can kind of see more of the shirt. Okay. I, I didn't lower it that much. But anyways, before I get into this video, I'm sorry, there's a fly in here. Before I get into this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Sorry. I don't know what happened there. But I'm going to wait for y'all to like and subscribe right now. You done? You done? All right. So, oh, before I get into the video, I have to show you guys one more thing. Hold on a sec. I know my screen is dirty. Don't even. Oh my God, my hair looks crazy. But y'all, I bought myself a MacBook Pro with the touch bar. Yes, I did. This is what I got to myself. It, I did get myself, but my mother helped me. Because, like, she had to sit. It's a whole thing. But at the end of the day, I did actually use this with my money. And I'm just proud of myself for buying this on. So, yeah. I'm really happy. I'm really proud of myself. You guys, if you guys are proud of me, I, I appreciate it. But anyways, let's just get into the video. Let's get into the video. Oh. Alright, y'all. So, I'm actually going to be using my MacBook right now. <laughs> To, oh yeah, yeah, I like my <laughs> you like my um screensaver? It's the Hamilton Casper as Legos. <laughs> so funny. You guys probably think I'm a nerd, but I mean I am a theater nerd when it comes to it because I 
I, I, I love, I just love plays. I love theater. I love the whole thing. Like, but anyways, um, yeah, I'm going to be looking at the, um, the look on my computer. I'm also going to be letting you guys see the look, of course. So I'm going to put it up here right now so you guys can see what kind of look it is. It's a look that Maddie did. And you can see that she has purple eyeshadow, but it's also glossy. So I think I'm going to put some um, lip gloss on my... It might sound weird, but if you do makeup and you know about editorial looks, then you know that, like, what I mean by that. But, yeah, I'm going to be... Um, I'm gonna be putting some gloss on it. All right, y'all. So I already primed my face with this that I got in my Ipsy bag. If you guys don't know what Ipsy is, this stuff is just really cute. So I want you to like look them up, Ipsy, I-P-S-Y. And cause this stuff is so nice. But this is, this is a matcha green tea anti-dioxin. Anti I can't read y'all, but it's a priming moisturizer. It's a priming moisturizer and it's lightweight. Like it literally says lightweight, oil free, water cream, prime skin for makeup. And it is very lightweight and it smells good. Like I don't think it smells like matcha. I, I actually have never had matcha anything, but if this is what it smells like, baby girl, I'm gonna stick to it. But do it all like her, everything. So let's just start with my brows, I guess. Okay, I actually got something from Ipsy again. So instead of me doing soap brows, <laughs> I actually start to use this. It's a eyebrow gel and it helps hold like my eyebrows in place. Like it's so good. So my eyebrows are not the best looking eyebrows for, for me to be putting them up like hers. But... I'm gonna do it since like I'm doing the her exact look. So I'm gonna try, guys. Like my eyebrows are just not, it's not meant for this look. Really, it's not. But I think, let me just see. I'm gonna keep going, guys. So I finished work um i think like last no two weeks ago and it was so it was so like it was so sad but also it, i was ex i was just happy because like it was um oh this one looks way better well, i'm not done but it looks way better than this one for sure but yeah it was i was sad but i was also happy because like i was always tired or whatever but like i was mostly like sad because I was really gonna miss them and I was gonna miss work and like I just really enjoyed working there and it really did teach me a lot of things um because I worked at a dialysis center it teach me a lot of things about dialysis and like what the patients have to go through and I was just really proud of myself it was a really like kind of emotional moment even though like I wasn't crying or anything um and my favorite my favorite lady there, she bought me a cake and it was just really beautiful. It was, <laughs> let me stop playing, but it was really nice. I, I might put the picture of me and her like here. Hold up, y'all. I'm gonna do the eyebrows off camera because I don't know why, but when I do my eyebrows on camera, it just never, it never works out. So I'm gonna do it off camera because I'm sorry if you guys want to see me do it, but I just can't. I can't because they be just giving me, they just be giving me a hard time on camera. So y'all, I, I decided to do regular brows instead of doing like the the soap brows or like the brows that are just like all sweeping upwards because this eyebrow, it just can't be doing that. It just doesn't like, it doesn't decide to stay up like that. This eyebrow looked really good. I don't know if you guys saw it liked how it looked i know you guys saw it but i don't know if you guys liked how it looked but i did and so i just decided to do regular brows they're not looking their best today but now we're gonna this now we're gonna just get into this makeup i'm really excited for this look and also i forgot to tell you guys that the person that did that recommended this look to me um alexia and layla <laughs> If you guys are watching this video, thank you for recommend recommending this to me because I just 
I just feel really special because you guys decide to bring this look to me. Me? Like. <laughs> but yeah. Alexia and Layla, thank you for telling me about this look. Because I already had other Euphoria looks in mind. Because like on my Pinterest. But I really love this look because, I mean, it's my favorite color. And it has like sparkles and glitter. And I, I just really like this look. So thank you guys. Um, Just thank you. Um, Right now, I'm just blending around my eyebrows to make sure. I'm looking in the mirror less, literally right behind this camera. So, yeah, I'm just making sure to blend as much as possible. Now, we're just going to get into this makeup. And let me look one more time on my, on my laptop. In the actual lid part, she has a purple, like a lavender purple, and then, like, she blended out words with like a pink a sparkly pink so i'm gonna use my two for a artist path palette because it has a lot of sparkly colors and it also has the the lavender that she's using so i'm gonna use this on my lids right now and then the pink that sparkly pink i think i'm gonna have to look at my uh, I think I'm gonna have to look into the um, James James Charles palette. Yeah, I'm just gonna work on the lavender right now. All right, so I'm going in with the purple. Also, if you are trying to do this look with me, that lavender in the 24A um, Artist Pass is called Stage Persona. It's the only lavender, so. I mean, it's not the only purple, so that's why. But it looks like this. Don't mind my dirty brush, but if you guys can see it, it's really pretty. I love lavender, I, as you can see. This is why this shirt goes so well. Oh my god, it's so pretty. Um, all right, so let me just talk to y'all. Let me just talk to y'all. So I was on Twitter. Oh, don't mind my mirror, the back of my mirror. I was on Twitter, because I've been on Twitter a lot lately, ever since like um work, because at work we had like slow days, and like I just didn't really have anything to do at the moment. So like I was just on my phone and then I was like, all right, I'm bored. Like I was getting tired of just being on TikTok. So I decided to go to Twitter because I have it, but I haven't actually been using it. Like only if there was like tea, tea that I need to find out, then I'll be using it. But now like I'm that type of person to like wake up and go on Twitter. Cause it's like, I don't know why I didn't find out about it earlier. I mean, not find out about it, but actually be into it until now um but i was on twitter the other day and there was a um, tweet so i'm about to tell this whole story wrong but that's the actual quote and it's saying the worst tragedy in music history and then the person retweeted it and said please let it go i'm a billy eilish fan okay like i haven't been listening to her music that much lately so i'm not gonna say i'm the biggest fan but I definitely used to be like a big, big fan. Like every new, every new song, every new album. I don't know if you guys know, but she won like five Grammys at the beginning of the year. I think it was the beginning of the year. And like people were surprised. And like, I mean, I was surprised too, but I was more so like proud of her and just really excited. But I know there was other people that was really like surprised. Like, why did she just win like five Grammys? And she's so young and whatever. So I know people were like upset about that. People that aren't Billie Eilish fans or just think that she's overrated and don't want to and don't want to even try to listen to her music. But like, come on now. Like, think about it. Like, she's 18, right? She's 18. And look at what she's doing. Like, she started when she was like 13, 14. And she, she already won five Grammys and like a whole bunch of other stuff. And she's already so big, like... Come on now, don't you think that's like an achievement? And plus, it's not like she hacked into the freaking ballot or whatever it's called and um, added another 100 votes to her name. Like she didn't do, like she literally didn't. I think people were saying that she didn't even wanna win that many. And I know she was surprised because when I was watching it and she kept, and they was and they kept saying her name and she was like, like at one point she was just like not even really like like she was just like confused i don't understand why you guys are mad at her because it's not really her it's not it's not really her decision right isn't it like the people's decision so i mean that's all i have to say about that 
Do y'all see it? Packing it all more so than like going like you know like going like these because I need as much of the color on my eyelids. And I'm actually trying to do it without putting tape on my eye. And I might actually decide to put tape, you know, like right there so it doesn't go too crazy. But I think I'm gonna try and do without it because I've been using tape long enough. I'm really liking how it's looking. So I think I'm gonna start to put some light pink now. Um, this light pink is called Indio Woke, right? Is this one right? Yeah, right here. It looks orange on camera, but I promise y'all, it's actually a really nice, like, light, hot pink something. Like, it looks it looks like a, like a tangerine looking color on camera, but I think that's a pretty good color. Um, I know that I have some light pinks in my James Charles palette. All right, y'all, so I have my James Charles palette, and I'm looking at the picture again. So I think I'm gonna take some of this pink um i don't know the name of it by heart and i take the thingy off but this light pink right here and i'm also going to take some of this sparkly pink right here because i see that it's sparkly and i'm gonna mix that i think i'm gonna mix all three indio bow and the two pinks that i just showed y'all i think i'm gonna mix all all of them together and then see how it looks from there and looks kind of like this on my on my um brush let me tell y'all about the music i've been listening to lately so if you know then you know that i love brent fires like i love his music so much and i know like almost every song and i go hard for him like yeah the, i don't know if you if you're a brent fan then you know that he's been he's been like strangely um trending on twitter because people are like, people are comparing him to Frank Ocean and I don't know how to say his name, Giveon. I also, I listen to both of them too. I'm hoping I'm saying his name right, Giveon. I feel like that's how you say it. Please don't compare them. Like I hate when people compare artists, like they're their own person. They all have their own stories when they're, when they're um, making their music. Like don't do that. Even if you think they have, they sound the same or whatever you might like their music for one reason and then another person might like their music for for another reason like it's i just it just irritates me when people compare artists like the whole Nicki minaj and cardi thing like and then megan getting into it like come on now like if you like megan then you like megan if you like cardi then you like cardi if you like Nicki minaj then you like Nicki minaj i personally like all three of them um their music um, I've been listening to Nicki Minaj way longer than I've been listening to Cardi B, but I still love Cardi's music. Um, and I also l like um, Megan's music, but I don't be comparing them or hating on one of them. Like, they're, they're all good, and they all, like, represent female artists in a way. They're all, like, inspirations to younger female artists especially rappers and they're all doing something good like in the rapping industry so like come on now stop doing that stop comparing artists to other artists it's not it's so annoying but yeah he's been trending on twitter like it's so strange <laughs> like one one day he's like trending and then the other day it's like something else but then he comes back because like at first he was trending because people were like making a rumor saying that he's making a new um he's making more music and he never said that but i wish he did oh because i was i thought he was he didn't expect himself to be trending but like his music is getting really big and i'm not liking i mean i'm happy for him but i'm not liking it for myself because he's supposed to be for me he wasn't supposed to be known like that he's supposed to be just for me but it's okay because I'm still gonna be the one of the biggest fans. I'm be one of your biggest fans, Brent. Okay? I love you, and I love your music. Anyways, I had to talk about that because I haven't been listening to I've I haven't been listening to Brent as much, and only because I've been trying to. 
find more artists to listen to, like newer artists to listen to. Um, because I want to expand my music taste, even though I know, I know my music taste. I know, like, uh, it's just immaculate. Like, I know it is. Okay, it's starting to come together, y'all. And I'm really liking how it's looking. Period. Now I'm gonna start to put some of this. It's literally called glittery. But I'm gonna. Oh. I'm gonna start putting some of this glittery pink in my crease area. Only a little bit. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna tap it in. Tap, tap, tap then. Because if you don't know, the 24 A palette that I'm using right now is in collab with Saweetie. So that's why I decided to say that. All right, y'all, so I did the other eye pretty quickly, actually, because this is not even a hard look to do. And now I'm about to, um, I don't know if I should put the gloss on. I think I should start doing the rest of my face, like foundation on this stuff before I start doing like the gloss and the eye, the eyeliner and all that stuff. This is like the perfect brush for foundation. And my foundation is like this. So I don't actually have to do this. I could just put the foundation on my face, but I want to do it like, I want to be like all these other people and do it with a brush. It actually, it actually works like way better. Y'all, don't look at my, don't look at all that, but look at the eyelid, like look how sparkly it is because I added the, the sparkly purple like, it's so pretty it makes it look really glossy like it, if it had the lip gloss on already um so i'm about to i'm about to wipe this all off my face all right y'all so i did my face um i'm not really liking the application and this right here i just have to be careful with it next time because too much goes a little bit too far like but now I'm about to try and do eyeliner. <laughs> maybe I should do, okay. Maybe I should put some of some glitter. Cause I just want to be a little bit more extra and just add some more glitter like around my face and all that stuff. I'm just going to add some glitter like right here under my eye, like right where, like right here because they do be having glitter under their eye and euphoria. So I'm just gonna add some glitter and some stars. I'm gonna show you guys what um, I'm using in a second. Okay. I love glitter. I love glitter. So like, that's another reason why I love the looks in this show. Like it's so pretty and the artist, that did their makeup. A plus, A plus, cause it was so pretty. Like, if you haven't watched before it yet, please watch it, cause it's so good. All right, y'all. So I don't know where I left off. <laughs> to be honest, put this dark purple, lighter purple, in the same on the other side. And now I'm about to start doing the. She did eight. She did eight of the diamonds on her eyelid so i'm about to do that right now all right so i got the diamonds um i don't know i know what size it's like a really it's like a medium-ish so i think i think i can't show you guys let me take one out guys it's so tiny Ugh, i don't know if you guys can see in my hand it's like that so i'm gonna use these ones and I already have my glue. This is the Too Faced Glitter Glue Glitter Shadow Primer. So, so I'm gonna use the back of this to like, you know, hold it. All right, so let me show you guys how I'm doing it. I'm putting it on the back of this brush <laughs> and then you can see, you can see that little pint of glue that I put on the diamond. All right, y'all, so I'm done with them i forgot to put the lip gloss on but i'm gonna try to put it on right now i'm gonna try to put it on my eyelids right now 
and then I'm gonna put on my lashes and I'm almost done. All right, y'all, so I got this rose hip one. I said rose hip or ro rose shirt. I don't know, but I got this lip gloss cause it's old and I don't use it. And I'm gonna, should I put it on a brush? And then do it or should i don't want to use one of my good brushes i think i should use an old brush i'm gonna use my lip one yep i'm use the lip one so i did both of the look the eyes okay now it's time for these lashes and let's pray real quick pray for me because i don't want to mess them up i don't want this to be the reason why Everything goes downhill. Let me let me, let me not even say anything. All right, y'all. So they're on. They're on. Now to put mascara on under to blend them. Do you guys like how I look with lashes on? Cause I feel like I look weird. Maybe cause I don't wear them like that. But I'd be like, I don't know if I like it. So now I'm gonna use this brownish. It's like a brown pink kind of lip liner. <sighs> All right, so I have two NYX, um, ah! two NYX lippies, <laughs> this darker um, pink and then this lighter pink, and then I have my e.l.f. sparkly pink lip gloss, so I'm gonna start with the dark first, and blend it in, I think that's good. And then I'm um, put some on the light in the middle. Guys, I know my hair looks crazy. I'm gonna fix it. Okay. I didn't even take I don't even think I take all the twist out. I think I'm done. So you guys can tell me how I did. In the comments below if it's on because sometimes it just turns off i don't be doing that guys i would not turn the comments off and then say comment down below in my video this is how it looks up close now that i'm finished with this look i'm gonna do my i'm gonna do my hair and then i'm gonna do the tiktok you guys are not gonna have to watch me do my hair i'm gonna just put the tiktok in here so you guys can see it and it's gonna play, I think it should play right now. Oh, stranger. Still don't know my name. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys liked the little, the little TikTok. Make sure to comment down below if you guys enjoyed this look. And if you guys want me to do any more, looks like this or if you guys are gonna try and do a euphoria look maybe even this one make sure to like comment and subscribe and make sure to turn that bell notification on so you can be notified every time i make a new video and i'm going to be making more videos and that's it for this video y'all love you love yourself and deuces <laughs>